We are Grassroots Garage, and this is a That's in Heaven series. On this episode of Grassroots Garage, That's in Heaven Part 9, we've got Ruel and his L16 powered 510. Grassroots Garage. Today I've got Ruel. Ruel, thanks for your time. Thank you for having me. Tell us about your car. Uh, it's a 1972 uh, 510. Um, got it back in the early, early, early mid 90s. Um, it's got original paint. Body's all original. Uh, I've tried to get rid of it for quite a while, but. Some of my other friends said don't do it because you know you get involved with family and my kids so that's that's pretty much it. It still has the L16. Uh, I built the motor myself. Uh, I put L20B pistons in it, uh, balanced uh, the uh, rods, the, the crank. Uh, it's got a W53 head on it. I ported, polished it myself, uh, put Iski springs in it. Uh, I put a hotter cam in it. I poured, did the porting myself. Uh, I has has a stock intake manifold, and I put a 38 degas Weber carb in it. Mm -hmm. uh, it's got uh, electronic uh, ignition, uh, 200 SX five speed, uh, brake booster, cooling fans, aluminum radiator by TSR. Uh, that's pretty much it. Beautiful. Goes pretty good for an L16. Huh? Well, you want to light it up? You light it up. Uh, it's kind of a long story because uh, it started uh, even early on when I used to do a lot of street racing. My first race car was a 77 Datsun 510. And then uh, I uh, first time I saw the 510 was one night when we had some money against a, a V8 uh, Chevy Monza and a white car I've never seen before. And my buddy got his ass handed to him pretty badly on a 510, and that's that's it. Yeah. Uh, so later on, a few years later, I had to get rid of the the car. Had my family moved out here, bouncing off the walls. You know, my wife said, "You got to get a car," and that's when I saw a 510, and it started at that point. Beautiful. So tell me about when you first got this car. We got original paint, but it had a vinyl roof. Yeah, it had uh, original paint. Uh, everything was factory on it. It had a vinyl roof. Uh, it was immaculate. Paid mm -hmm. eighteen hundred bucks for it. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> not, anymore. Say, not anymore. Not anymore. Not anymore. Um, got it here locally. Oh, yeah, uh, yeah. yeah, close to Temecula here. Yeah, and uh, had factory uh, steel wheels on it. Uh, everything was factory, all original. Mm -hmm. uh, low miles, uh, well taken care of. Beautiful. Until I got a hold of it. <laughs> <laughs> Love that. And that's it for Grassroots Garage Royal. Thanks for your time. Thank you very much. Appreciate it. Done. We'd like to say a massive thank you to Ruel for taking some time out of his day to come hang out with us. Now on the next step, you might have seen this little red wagon lurking in the background. This is owned by John Williams and it's absolutely stunning. Thanks for watching and stay tuned for the next one.